guys welcome to Datri solutions today i'm going to show you a website called crowdfunding nowadays deadly diseases are increasing day by day many people are ab not able to afford the cost of treatment and sadly they are losing their lives due to lack of treatments to reduce these cases we have came up with an idea called crowdfunding it is a website where donors can donate the money to the hospitals to help poor people for the treatments and these funds will be given for the treatments of the poor people so this is the website and here we have five modules those are admin hospitals verifier seeker and donor this is the flow diagram of the website here the admin will log in into the website with the login credentials like email address and password after login into the website the admin can add and view the locations and add and view the verifiers after this, the hospitals will register into the website by giving their name, details, hospital address, etc. After registration, the admin can view the hospitals and authorize them. After authorizing only, the hospitals can log in. Coming to the seekers, the seekers will register will get registered into the website with the uh, details like name, email address, password, and the cause those are all information can be uh, filled with the registration form and after registrations the admin can view the seekers and admin can view the seekers and authorize them after authorization the seekers will log in into the website with the login credentials like the uh, registered email address and password after login into the website the seekers will raise the fund by giving the details of the uh, diseases and cause of diseases and uh, their treatment both cost and um, that their problem they raise the fund request they raise the fund request and if they want to cancel their fund request they can cancel the fund request also by clicking the cancel button these uh, fund requests will be viewed in the hospitals view fund request page the hospitals can view the fund request and accept or reject the fund request after accepting the fund request the admin can view the fund requests and accept them or reject them after if admin can accept the fund request the admin can assign the verifier can assign the verifier and to verify this to verify this uh, seekers information and fund request um, after verifying the fund uh, after adding the verifier the verifier will get login into the website and they can view the fund request after viewing the fund request the verifier can verify the disease and the fund request request uh, seeker they check the details of the request and they verify the request and accept them or uh, if it is a valid request the uh, verifier can accept the request and if it is not valid they'll reject the request after accepting uh, verifier accepting the fund request the donors will get registered into the website and login into the website directly after login the donors can donate the funds to in two ways those are donate fund and donate fund for cause in donate fund page in donate fund page the donors can donate the funds direct uh, directly in the fund uh, crowdfunding if they want to donate the money directly to the seekers they can choose the donate fund for cause they can uh, give the uh, donations to the seekers directly if these all donated information will be stored in the view don view fund transactions in the donor page and after donating the money the admin can view the donated fund in the view fund amount and uh, these all the donated funds will be viewed by the admin and those uh, donations like cause and fund crowd crowdfunding and cause funding me uh, both the transactions will be viewed by the admin in the view fund transaction history so after after the fund transaction history they can check the fund transactions and overall count of the transactions will be appear in the view fund transaction history page coming to the website let's see the output 
admin admin will log in into the website with the name ad, username and password i'm giving the password here login this is the admin home page admin can add and view the locations so i'm adding the locations here add location here the admin can view the locations so admin can add verifiers add the verifiers with the name verifier email address verifier phone number verifier password verifier location and address add verifier so okay after adding the verifier we will add we will register like a hospital i am registering the hospitals uh, email address phone number password hospital type kya hua hospital code and account number address locations choose locations here and register hospital register successfully and after registration the admin can authorize the hospitals and again login into the admin page and we can view the hospitals here and by clicking the authorized button we can authorize the hospitals here the status will be changed as authorized and log out after adding the hospital the seekers will register into the website registration seekers name and seekers email address seekers phone number password choose location register after seekers registration the admin can give the authorization to the seekers so i am again logging into admin page and view the seekers by clicking clicking this authorized button the admin can authorize the seekers so here also the uh, status will be changed as authorized and again so uh, i'm logging into the seekers seekers page email address and password login after login into the website the seekers will raise the fund by giving the hospital name and raise amount how much they want so i am entering 50000 here image of the ray seeker image and cause 
Um, please help me for treatment. So I am uploading the reports here. Report of the seeker. So raise fund request. Seeker raised fund request successfully and raised fund request will be displayed on the fund request page. This is the fund request page. If they want to cancel the fund request, raised fund request, they can cancel by clicking the cancel request button. And by, cl by clicking the view reports button, we can view the uh, reports of the seeker. So seekers will raise the fund request. This fund request will be sent to the hospitals. So I'm adding like hospital. I'm logging into the hospitals page. So email address and password. This is the hospital homepage. View fund request. Here the fund request will be displayed. After viewing the reports, the hospitals can accept or reject the fund request. After accepting the fund request. This fund, uh, fund request history and this fund request will be sent to the admin. I'm logging into the admin again, and this is the admin homepage. And you can view the fund request. And after adding the fund request, you can add the verifier to verify this particular case. The admin can assign the verifier for this but, uh, request. So I'm adding the verifier. So go to verifier and check. We'll check the fund request. This is the verifier homepage. Here the verifier can view the fund request. And after verifying the reports, after viewing and verifying the reports of the seeker, the fund uh, the verifier can accept or reject if it is valid reports they can accept the fund request and if it is not valid they can reject the fund request so it is a valid request so i am accepting the fund request after accepting the fund request the donors will log in to register into the website donor donor name donor phone number and donor password choose location so by clicking this register button donor will register into the website after registration the donor will get login into the website e with email address and password this is the password and this is the home page for donor and here the donor will donate the fund by entering the amount how much he want to donate he will donate so by entering the money and the card number this card number should be in 16 digits and card holder name CVV number, expiry date, send amount. This is the crowdfunding. If here the uh, donor will be sent the money to the crowdfunding, into the crowdfunding. If they want to donate the fund in for cause, particularly the seeker, they can click on this uh, button and they can view the reports of the seeker and verify the uh, seekers in uh, fund request information and by uh, by entering the amount here they can donate the money to the seekers directly so i am donating here also so after clicking the donate button we can enter into the this payment page so this is the card number entering the card number here 
this must be in 16 digits card holder name Susila and CVV number expiry date send amount Don donate fund for cause also done this all uh, donated food details uh, donated cause details will be fund details will be viewed in the transactions view donation transactions these are the donation transactions first we are donated the uh, crowd fund and we can, again we are donated cause fund so again we'll go to admin and admin can view these funds all the funds and verify them view fund request you can view the fund request also and fund amount this is the crowd fund amount and fund history fund history will be here here we are this is the amount we are donated so like this the um, donors will donate the amounts to the seekers for their treatments this is the crowdfunding website thank hope you guys all understand thank you